Christmas traditions! Okay, I am so excited for Christmas and December in general because A, I really need off from school. I know that I can't even possibly compare to the work you guys are doing and all your smart college stuff, but also I'm under all the, the stress of applying, so I'm really looking forward to just getting it in and then being able to relax and then going crazy when I don't get accepted. Going absolutely crazy, because... Yeah. Uh, my extended family, my brother and I, have a tradition with our uncle, which is really awesome and kind of weird. Um, every year, my uncle gives my brother and I the same present um, when he comes over to celebrate uh, for Christmas Day, because I have, like, a gigantic family with, like, you know, hundreds of, well, dozens of people coming over. So there's no real time to, like, talk to a lot of people, but this one uncle, he always gives uh, my brother and I $50.00 but never in the same way. So, every year, I start, since my brother was about, I don't know, seven and I was five or something, he has found a creative or cool way to give it to us. Like, it started out simple when my brother was, I think, yeah, like seven years old. Um, he got a tissue box that had a, just a tab on it that said, pull here. And he started pulling, and it was one fifty one dollar bills all taped to one another in this line and since my brother was so little he was like it's never ending ah it's so cool so yeah as we got older um my brother got a box of pasta with um certain certain little pasta shells had the, like one dollar bills rolled up and put inside the uh, the pasta shell that he had to like break the shells and get out uh, mine were sealed inside 50 envelopes that I had to open up. I got a lot of paper cuts that year. But then we started getting way older, and it, it just basically got sadistic. Um, my brother's was frozen in ice. His money was frozen in ice once. And he couldn't just let it melt. He had to microwave it. Made a mess. Um, sealed in a candle... It was inside the center of a perfectly good candle, and the wick wasn't burned or anything, and I have no idea how he did it. I think he must have gone to the place where you make candles and then put the money inside and then made the candle. I don't know. Um, last year, my brother's was encased in a block of cement. Cement. He baked my brother's in bread one year. Don't ask me how it didn't get burned. I have no idea. Um, he made mine into the shape of a bowler hat. By gluing many quarters together. But the best one was when I... There was a gigantic box for me. And I opened it up and there was a watermelon inside. To this day, I have no idea how he got it inside. Because there were no seams or anything where he had opened it up and put it in. I checked it all over. I was like... 13, so I, I'm, I'm guessing I couldn't have been fooled that easily. I checked the whole thing all over. No, it was just a gigantic watermelon. And that, that was the most amazing feeling in the world. I broke open a gigantic watermelon with a sledgehammer. And inside was, were, was a $50 bill. Yeah, Christmas traditions. So I'm really excited for the break because... I will be hopefully done applying to colleges, and Chelsea and Jenna, you guys will be home for a little while at least. So, that would be lovely. Okay, um, I'm gonna go. Bye!